By the way, how about Ryan Seacrest? He leaves LA. We have Yay. mudslides. Yes. We've got wildfires, <laughs> plagues of locusts. Are you? What was it coincidence? Greg, I don't know. Greg, are you here blaming Ryan for all of that? Are you pointing the finger? I'm saying it's a little odd. Well, now do you live? You live near where the fires were. Right? I do. Actually, were you okay? Not, I was not uh, too far. One of the bigger fires. Uh, was just a few miles away. We woke up. It was a crazy week. It was a really disturbing week. We woke up one morning, and the uh, the announcement we got was they were advising, highly advising, that we evacuate and be on standby evacuation. Oh so it turns out the only thing worse than being evacuated is being told to stand by to evacuate. Yeah. That'll shoot your nerves. Right. So Can we... It is so, it's so fast, and it can spread and turn on a dime and pick up speed out of nowhere, right? Absolutely, and the kids are home from school, right. and there's smoke, and we've got the news running because you're trying to figure out what's going to happen. And At any rate, we, we, we kind of made it through the week, and it was terrible what happened out there. People mm. lost their you know, homes, and their, it was awful. And we made it through the week, and kids went back to school. Everything was okay. It's the end of the week. Oh, we are shot. I go into my daughter, 8-year-old, Go in her bed, bedroom, try to put her to bed, and she says, uh, Mommy, Daddy, we need to evacuate. And I'm thinking, honey, th th we're not doing jokes anymore, okay? This is, we, we can't play around with this. It's been a tough week. It's time to go to bed. She says, no, really, we need to call 911. I say, honey, I'm turning the light out. We're going to bed. Turn the light out. Sure enough, the room is glowing orange, which is odd. I look behind her curtain and see what she had seen, which is the house directly across the street is on fire. Wow. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. That close. It's that close, oh right across the street, which was crazy. So I go into complete panic mode. We get the, uh, my wife and I load up the dogs, the guinea pigs, the, 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 the fish. I try and make a play for the fish are in water. We don't need to take the fish, but that's a non-starter. <laughs> right, right. Yeah. We get everything loaded up. We call 911. The people across the street are fine. Everybody gets out. And it was just the end of a hellish week. We yeah. made it to the bottom, and the fire trucks so came and put it out. you did end up really evacuating. We really did. And by the way, it was just a random situation. It wasn't had nothing to do with the wildfires. It was a random electrical fire in a house. Are you kidding? On the week that it happened. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. Oh, my. By the way, thank God your daughter is alert and paying attention to the yeah. neighbors How to about save that? her family. I, I, I mean. She's eight. She's eight. I have to, I have to take her literally now, forever. Yeah. Where yeah. you know, yeah. she says, "Daddy, I'm starving." I'm like, "Oh my gosh, we're gonna feed you." Yeah.